Hey, it's Kevin. Welcome to the video blog. Happy Thanksgiving wherever you are in the world, or even if it's not Thanksgiving by the time you're viewing this. Uh, I think it's important we always take time to reflect on, on what good we have in our life, the things we have to be thankful for. Even though I live 500 miles away from my, my wife, the love of my life, I'm still very thankful for the life I have, for the ability to get up every day and do what I do for a living, or, or just be able to get up every day to enjoy life for what it is. And even in, in times of economic uncertainty for all of us, we still have so many joys in life, and we still do live in the, in the greatest country in the world with so many freedoms and, and so many privileges. And if you look by me, so much excess. I said excess, not success. Um, Thanksgiving has always been a strange day for me. In fact, you'll find there will probably be an uh, interweaving theme throughout the next month or so as we kind of enter the holiday season. I am not the biggest holiday kind of guy. I think it's because growing up, um, you know, I had a small family. Um, I didn't have a lot of extended family. So our holiday celebrations were pretty small. Um, because my father worked in the media, there wasn't a lot of time off. Um, he always worked on Thanksgiving. He almost always worked on, on Christmas. So it, it, it made it kind of tough. Um, and again, sadly, I, I kind of tend to be that way today. Um, I, I don't really get into the holidays too much. Um, I haven't done Thanksgiving, I think, with my parents. Wow, in, in um, what, uh, probably since 1982, since my senior year of college. I don't think we've spent Thanksgiving together. We've always been at separate points uh, across you know, America. Um, we did do Thanksgiving with my in-laws for a while back in Indiana. The traveling got to be too much. The drama got to be too much. Um, you know, I, and, and especially now that I live, it's, it's a matter of just as long as I'm with my wife, I'm happy. It's been great to be back here for a couple of days to spend time with the cat. Which I, I actually, I've got a blog post in mind talking about the cats and how special they are to me. And it's kind of rare for a guy. But anyway, I, I'm digressing. Um, we do have a, a neat tradition that we've had the last eh, three or four years. Um, where we get together with, with friends and their families. Um, back when we first started, we all worked together. Um, my morning man from WAKRAM, Ray Horner, and his wife Melissa and their family. Um, my news director, one of my best friends in the world, and his wife, uh, Ed Esposito, and his wife Diane. Um, we all kind of get together at, at, at Ray's house, and sometimes Ray's got family in, um, sometimes other friends come in, sometimes um, single dads, single moms, single whoever. Um, it, it, it makes for a fun time. It makes for a great Thanksgiving. And isn't that what it's about? Sharing it with loved ones, sharing it with friends. No matter where I am in the world, though, and, and there is a post that's not just a happy Thanksgiving post, um, the past the cranberries has some symbolic nature for me. My mother's not the greatest cook, and as I said, Thanksgiving is not a big tradition in our family. But there is one tradition in my life that continues on. And when I pulled into the house on, on Monday night at midnight on Thanksgiving and went straight to the refrigerator, I made sure that what I saw in the refrigerator was my Ocean Spray Jelly Cranberry Sauce. Yes, the kind, the nasty kind, the roll in a can where you... Uh, how do you cut the tops and bottoms of these cans now? They continue changing them. Um, and then you squeeze it out and you cut it in slices. My mother served that as a kid. For some reason, I, I love it. I, I don't, by the way, like the new can, the fancy blue color and the serving suggestion I don't need it. Give me the plate with it cut up on there and I'm happy to go um, I don't care if there's six kinds of, of cranberry relish or whatever you want to call it I always come with a can of, of ocean spray um, that's my tradition now my wife likes that nasty green bean casserole thing and she prefers regular stuffing stuff, you know I don't care I, I don't even care if it's turkey it could be lasagna which I think was what, probably what my buddy Boo is, is serving today, or if he's doing the Italian Thanksgiving. But Thanksgiving is about spending time with loved ones, spending time together with friends, and most importantly, carrying on traditions. I don't have kids to pass this tradition on to, so find a tradition, whether it's the cranberry sauce or whatever it is, and, and spread it with those you love. Happy Thanksgiving. Back with you tomorrow for our Black Friday edition of the Daily Vlog. I worked in retail for a long time, so I've got a lot of stories I can tell you. We'll talk. Uh, we'll talk some shopping tomorrow in the blog. Happy Thanksgiving.